Impact Wrestling presents Against All Odds. Live June 9th on Impact Plus and Fight. The 8 4 1 match, certainly unorthodox for Against All Odds. Can Nick Aldis earn the Impact World title shot at Slammiversary? Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is set for one fall. Introducing first, accompanied to the ring by Alicia Edwards from Boston, Massachusetts. Kitty Edwards! Meanwhile, there's a man who this past Friday night right here in London, Ontario, attempted to capture an Impact World title shot for against all odds. However, in that six-way dance, the brawling between Eddie Edwards and Frankie Kazarian derailed that effort for both men. Yeah, this got very tense, very personal between Edwards and Kazarian in quick match. Kazarian taking a lot of exception to the way Eddie Edwards can ducks himself in this business, particularly in the locker room with a lot of the younger talent. And you see the attitude of Edwards is out full force. Make an impact on your performance and well-being with the best-selling Test Booster, Test X9 from Legacy Sports Nutrition. Go to LegacySupps.com and use the code IMPACT for 20% off and level up with Legacy. His opponent from Japan, Yuya Uemura. Uemura was also involved in that six-way dance at Under Siege. Frankly, it came down to Uemura and Alex Shelley as the last two men standing. Obviously, as we saw before the break, Alex Shelley will challenge Steve Macklin for the Impact World title one week from tomorrow and against all odds. Yeah, but all the credit in the world to Yuya Uemura for standing toe-to-toe -to -toe with some of the best of the best in Impact Wrestling in that six-way scramble match, which means he's standing toe-to-toe -to -toe with some of the best of the best in professional wrestling. Now, we can tell you at this time, as you saw before the commercial break, the Motor City Machine Guns put out a challenge for a tag team matchup later on tonight against what they hoped would be the Impact World Champion Steve Macklin and Bully Ray. Macklin and Bully didn't seem to want any part of the guns this evening, but Subculture did. This is official. Our main event still to come, Subculture versus the Motor City Machine Guns in a first time ever dream match also so to come this evening in the tag team ranks decay take on ove buddies sammy callahan and jake chris also meanwhile in the knockouts division we saw danny luna of subculture moments ago she battles jody threat and also trinity will be in action here in london ontario against savannah evans and meanwhile the action is still breaking down in the ring right now. You know, we talk about Kazarian's issues with Eddie Edwards, how he is as, as a leader, as a representative of the locker room. And here he is with one of the youngest, brightest stars of Impact Wrestling in Yuya. It's going to be a prime uh, feeding ground here for Kazarian to see what kind of man, what kind of competitor Eddie Edwards is with the young talent. Beautiful series of arm drags here by Yuya Uemura. One thing we uh, talked about on the broadcast at Under Siege is Eddie Edwards and Frankie Kazarian, their roots run deeper than many people think. Both men were trained by the late, great Killer Kowalski Kazarian before Eddie Edwards. And it just seems like two guys have gone in very different directions from the tutelage of Kowalski. Yeah, despite that common oh. beginning, taking their careers, at least in, in the recent history, Eddie Edwards used to be, I think, probably what Kazarian would consider the right kind of wrestler, the right kind of leader for the locker room. There was a long time where Eddie Edwards was con considered the heart and soul of Impact Wrestling, but in recent years, that has very much changed. Uh, hammering away here on Yuya Uemura. Biggest match of Uemura's life at Under Siege. Edwards could care less about that. Well, and that's the thing, you know, Kaz can say all he wants about how he thinks Eddie Edwards should conduct himself and the, the kind of representative he should be, the example he should be. But Eddie Edwards is out here. He ain't here to make friends. He ain't here to, to make students, to make devotees, mentees, if you will. No, he's still here to win. He wants championship gold. He wants money. He wants success. He's about Eddie Edwards. Come on, Yuya. Come on. And he's right now, Eddie Edwards in firm control of Yuya Uemura. In fact, this is some of the best lessons I think Yuya's gonna get. You learn the hard way, kid, whether you like it or not. Impact will be in Columbus, Ohio for Against All Odds. One week from tomorrow, live on Impact Plus Fight TV and YouTube for our Ultimate Insiders. 
on Friday, June 9th, and the night after is on the fallout from Against All on Saturday, June 10th. Tickets are on sale now at ImpactWrestling.com. Mora just firing up at Forum, driving Edwards all the way to the floor, and now Mora flying through the air. Edwards is down. Can he get back in it? Yuria is rolling. This match continues here on Access TV. Oh, and we are back here on Impact Wrestling on Access TV. The two-time Impact World Champion, Eddie Edwards, pulverizing Yuya Uemura after taking control during the commercial break. In fact, let, let's take you back to the commercial break. It was Yuya Uemura rolling before we headed to commercial, but during the break, Alicia Edwards reached in, grabbed the leg of Uemura here, allowing the distraction, which had Eddie Edwards get up with this huge maneuver, and it has been all Eddie Edwards ever since. We invite you to join us in Memphis, Tennessee at Graceland Live for Mid-South Mayhem on Friday, September 22nd and Saturday the 23rd. Tickets go on sale tomorrow at impactwrestling.com. Uomura trying to get back up to his feet. Eddie Edwards has a lot of frustrations as of late. has been tangling with Frankie Kazarian amidst our main event a few weeks ago here on Access TV in a six-man tag team matchup before Under Siege. And then those two were brawling throughout the six-way dance at Under Siege. Yeah, it was during much of that matchup. Cover by Edwards to put away Yuya kick out. That, that it felt like there were multiple matchups going on, one of those being Kazarian and Edwards just constantly getting at each other's throats, rolling on the outside. Meanwhile, with all the other action from that six-way match taking place, you could not contain Kazarian and Edwards. Tomorrow, Retro Night on Access TV is alive and kicking at 8 p.m. Eastern, starting with the very, very best of the Yankees. Then it's the Monkees, and it's nothing but trailers flashback. Don't miss Retro Night here on Access TV. Look, to Kazarian's point, coming up in this business as a wrestler, as somebody who competes out there in that ring night in and night out, I had some wonderful, wonderful veterans, including people like AJ Styles, I've had some wonderful conversations with who led me down the right path at certain times. But I'll be honest, a lot of the tip top competitors in the industry, they're looking out for number one, and I have to believe that's what Eddie Edwards is all about right now. Because his goal is to get back to that championship any way he can. Oh! Knows what it's like to be at the top of Impact Wrestling, as we mentioned. And now Uemura on oh! the move, picking up the pace, and down goes Edwards. Yeah! Uemura kicking open the door here. Coming alive. And this is what makes Uemura so... So talented, he's always got heart, got that fighting spirit. You can never, ever count him out. Now, Uemura. Oh! Going to back suplex there on Edwards. Can he put him away? This will be a huge win for Uemura and a kick out. Uemura came very close a number of weeks ago in Toronto, knocking off another former world champion in Moose one-on-one. -on -one. He is so good, there's so much potential. I'm just waiting for that one, that breakout victory. Could have been under Siege Hail, it could be here tonight. He's one win away from getting on a roll that could lead him to very, very high places. Trying to trap the arms there. Eddie Edwards did a nice job dropping his body weight. Oh! And a kick right to the skull. Now, strapping it up here, looking for that backpack driver. No. Uh -oh. oh, and Yuya turns it around on Edwards. Oh, now the no. underhook. Nice job there by Uemura. Uemura yeah. going up top, looking to capitalize here. Oh, now Alicia Edwards is up on the apron, trying to slow up Yuya and does enough to distract Uemura to help Eddie Edwards get back in this. Ride or die indeed. Stand by your man no matter what. Well, now look at Edwards going all the way to the top here with Yuya Uemura. Oh, look out below the top of the top. On a superplex oh. by Edwards. Uemura bouncing off the canvas there. And you see him now writhing in pain. Edwards ready to put this one away. 
And now Edwards. Oh! Maybe he was thinking about the Boston knee party, but a beautiful drop kick by Yuya. The resilience oh! of Uomura and the strength. Slamming Edwards down, but Yuya knows he's not done yet. He's got to pour it on. To come back from that super flex and fire up like this, this is hard. Beyond belief from Uomura. Uomura going to the top turnbuckle. He loves this cross body. Oh! oh! And a knee by Edwards. Right to the ribs. I was trying to set up Yuya for a Tiger driver. Got, Got it! it! Shoulders down! Yeah. Edwards! Oh, he can't put him away! And Alicia on the outside in disbelief. And now Edwards, Boston knee party! Cover! Edwards takes out Omar. Here is your winner, Eddie Edwards! You may not like the way he does it, but Eddie Edwards, in his own way, just taught a lesson to Uemura that he didn't have what it takes to get it done tonight. Time to pick up, time to get better and come back. And in his own way, that's the kind of leader that Eddie Edwards is oh, in this locker room. Give me a break. To be fair. To be fair. Eddie Edwards utilizing his wife to gain distractions in this matchup to put away Yuya Uemura, who continues to climb the ranks here. Is this really the type of veteran you want in your locker room in Eddie Edwards? Hey, at the end of the day, it was a Tiger driver and then a Boston B party for the one, two, three. Now a rare a show of respect from the veteran. Eddie Edwards, you love to see it. <laughs> and another lesson learned. Don't trust Eddie. Beth, don't trust anyone. Absolutely Wait, classless here by Eddie Edwards. And look who's joining us here in the impact zone. Frankie Kazarian is here! Eddie, Eddie, I find it hilarious that you go out of your way to let everybody know that you're this locker room leader, and you're this veteran that everyone needs to respect, yet you refuse to return that same respect to a hungry young lion like Yuya that just took you to the absolute limit. Really? Women? Women? Okay, women? Yes. That's not how business is handled in this locker room. And that's certainly not the way you and I were trained to conduct ourselves, Ed. Oh! oh. Well, oh, look out! Oh, now Alicia jumping on Kazarian. Trying to get involved. Oh, God, hey, come on, that's the man's wife. Oh, Alicia jumped on Kazarian, come on. Right after Kazarian took a cheap shot on Eddie Edwards oh, on Eddie the Edwards ramp. Eddie Edwards deserved that. And he put his hands on Kazarian first. Come on. For coming out here, giving a kid like Yuya Uemura a great match, a great lesson, and they were repaid like that by Kazarian. Come on. Eddie Edwards, an example of a toxic presence in the locker room. Frankie Kazarian putting Edwards in his place.